Hello everybody, welcome back to my 60 second self-taught software engineering tutorial. So today we are going to talk about monolithic and microservice architecture. 60 second, let's get into it. So before going into our topic, which houses do you prefer to live? This one, all of your family living together in the same house. Or this one, everyone living in the same neighborhood but different houses. This is called monolithic and this one is called microservice. And this is the structure of a monolithic application. It's very common to see nowadays. Um, it consists of user interface, backend data interface, and a single database. So when we are maintaining this kind of application, we maintain it in the same place together here in one single application. But it's very different for microservices. Everything is breaking down into a small component which has its own service and database. The good thing about microservices is that everything is separate. We don't have to maintain them in a big chunk of the application, so it's very maintainable. Um, for example, if that one's broken, everything is still running well because they are not linked together unless we call them through API. We can just fix that one and then um, put it back again and it, it will run like usual. So for monolithic application, if, for example, if there is a bug here, everything will be corrupted. So that's the difference between monolithic and microservice. So that's it for our 60 seconds of self-taught software engineering. I hope you learned something quick and easy and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit like if you like this video and I will see you on the next 60 seconds again. Bye!